Okay, super so welcome everybody. This is weekly live. Let me test if we are audible and visible clearly. My microphone is there. Okay, so welcome everybody. This is weekly live. Let me test if we are audible. And one, two, three, one, two, three. Let me test it. We are clearly audible this time. <laughs> I literally forgot my microphone. That's strange. Uh, okay, now it's good. Okay. Let me see. Let me see. Let me see. Meanwhile, you can come in if you're watching this live, hashtag live. If you're watching this replay, hashtag replay. This is going to be an interesting topic traffic. And I have some slides. I spent 60 minutes to create these slides every single week. I spent some time every single week. I'm learning new and new things. And people who are new here, I go live weekly to explain one topic related to booking calls. So booking call is a process, step-by-step -step process, and I'm breaking that into four different parts, four parts. First is uh, traffic, second is leads, third is nurturing, fourth is booking calls. So step-by-step, -step, I'm explaining everything. Every topic is deep, but still, you know, I'm going to, you know, go deeper and deeper into single topic, and I'm going to go give you homework for seven days. You do it home. If you can do that homework best, if you don't, <laughs> so... Yeah, and I'm, I'm telling you, whatever I'm teaching you, this is the same, this is paid part. This is something that I, you know, actually work with my clients, paid clients. So you're getting this free. If you are getting this type of knowledge out of, you know, somewhere else on Facebook or any other app or somewhere, then tell me and I'll also, you know, consume that type of knowledge. So let's, let's go forward with this. Just me double check my audio. app or somewhere, then tell me and I'll also, it's good. It's good. Good to go. Mm. It's new microphone. Rapid scaling system traffic. Okay. Um, now the last lecture we covered customer journey. So if you have completed that homework about creating a customer journey, then very good. It will definitely help your business. It's it's not for me, of course. I'm giving you homework so that you will level up you will go to the next step you will have something that you would have so if you are doing homeworks and i'm i have decided not to delete all the <laughs> lectures that i'm going live because there are so many new people joining every week so they will not have the access of those lectures so that's why i'm going to keep those lectures please do the homework it's for your i'm, I'm going live i'm creating slides for you so all effort i'm putting for you so let's let's go forward Rapid scaling system traffic. So we can have traffic. Now this is pretty good, pretty powerful traffic. Uh, pretty powerful topic. Uh, traffic is the first part. If you want to book calls, okay. And before traffic, what we need is we need attention. If we have attention, then we have traffic, right? That means people are consuming our content. They are seeing, they are viewing our content, right? This is traffic. And after traffic, the next process is pulling out interested people who are interested in our offer, our service, our product. From those thousands and thousands of traffic, we have to take that interested people out, which we will call leads. And out of those hundreds of leads, the next process is we have to nurture those interested people. And then out of those hundred people, some of them will, you know, take our services that's booking calls or that's selling them right step by step process of booking calls from scratch traffic leads nurturing book calls let's go to the next step um uh, this is pretty interesting topic like the fastest way to create you can see there is traffic secret right behind me i am going to tell you more and more concepts so this is something that is booked by russell Brunson. if you haven't read that book go for it the fastest way to create traffic is to steal it. And there are dozens of ways to steal traffic. Stealing officially, uh, not, you know, uh, like, you know, stealing, like, you know, not telling to someone else and like that. It's like legally stealing the traffic. So, and the safest way to create traffic is to build it. So today we are going to talk about building the traffic because stealing traffic is something 
you can say strategy it is a trick something which will give you immediate traffic like thousands and thousands of traffic we're not going to talk about that we are going to talk about an ethical way like that is creating traffic creating your own traffic building your own traffic you know? and it's a long term game so there are dozens of ways to generate traffic but the safest and long lasting that i want to prefer is to create content and distribute it as much as possible you create as much as possible content and you distribute it as much as possible because again talking about stealing the traffic it's something like ads it's something like one time you know you'll have that traffic but how you're going to get the inbound lead to the trust and inbound traffic every single day that's the challenge and that's why i'm more focused on building the traffic creating the traffic so that it will long lasting traffic if you have coming that traffic every single day you can pull interested people out of that traffic so let's go to the next part next slide traffic okay you can see there are this is just i think let me count 1 2 3 4 1 2 3 4 10 ways there are more 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 there is infinite number of ways of creating traffic literally literally you can think of different different ways i've written in some of the examples and today we are going to talk about daily posting of content this one part of the creating traffic think of other parts you know there is lots of ways lots of layers in every single thing so today i'm going to cover daily posting of content which is the right hand of business online business content so this is something you know you can see you can see how many ways to generate traffic let's go to the next part so let's talk about this content creation literally very important part so content is the right hand of online business if you're not if you're not creating content every single day then there is no online business and there is no future for your online business this is something that i am not telling this is big is telling every single person who is earning six figure seven figure who is having traffic leads clients online business they are working on content so you, uh, you might have seen if you are connected to me on facebook you might have seen this type of twitter screenshot short form content i'm spreading every single day without missing from last 300 400 days every single day these are short pieces of content i'm posting so there is a format twitter screenshot which is format and i'm posting it every single day consistently short type of format short type of content and i'm getting very positive replies about this twitter screenshot and people are actually loving this type of content and i've got some of the inbound leads in a weekly i'm getting inbound leads from only this twitter screenshot why because of the consistency i'm posting it every single day let's go to the next step these are the long form content now i'm posting long form content as well uh four five times a week so you can see the engagement for the long form content is also very good 45 and 32 comments which is pretty good and creating long form content plus short form content plus videos something like that you can create the, your own combination we'll not talk about that we'll just talk about the content creation is something that will give authority build authority and tell your clients that you are a thought leader in your field so you have to create short form plus long form content because there are different types of people some who just want to consume short tweets short type of content some are they're just scrolling and they just need to consume it quickly some of there are readers they want to consume deeply so you can talk about this long form post mid form post something like that the creating short form posts has no framework you just write because i'm using twitter screenshot i'm writing on twitter every single day i spend 3 4 minutes on twitter just i write down and you know drop my comments and everything and then that's it and i take screenshot and then i take distribute that screenshot on other social media platforms and talking about long form content yes there is a framework to uh write long form post because most of the time i'm seeing people are posting only and only educational post which is not a good thing educational posts are not here going to give you clients because we are going to talk about that because in uh, slides ahead so let's go to the next step oh uh, by the way if you haven't if you're new on this in this group or if you're someone so how to write long form posts set with format with framework how to write my long form posts with framework 
every single day consistently without missing and without spending hours and hours then go to the pinned comment and you can see three or four, third or fourth um, link in the pinned comment click on that and download those lectures or watch those lectures i've explained everything step by step how you have to write the post that will actually give you leads okay let's go to the next step now how to build quality content quality traffic with content we want people who are actually good and who want to consume our content right now listen to this traffic is equal to real people reading watching listening to your content right because of course when i'm scrolling on social media or other people who are scrolling on social media they want to consume something something on this social media platforms right so there are real people out there and these are the your exact target audience maybe right so traffic is something who are real eyes who are watching or listening or you know reading your content and think about how you can have their attention which is the base of traffic if you do not have the attention they will not stop they will not read your content they will not watch they will not listen so whenever i am presenting everything anything or whenever i am explaining any topic you take my all videos i'm going into the basics of that topic the real principles the real base the real foundation is something that i would i want to work i love to work on it's not something always strategy and tricks and all and all so think about how you can have that attention attention is the biggest currency and on social media every single business who want to do business want to make sales want to make leads want to generate money they are looking for attention you have to think how you can have that attention so why should people consume your content is the first question that you want to ask yourself i, I think you might say you might say this this is a boring lecture and i know all the things and all and all but go ahead let me go ahead let me read another slides and it will be an aha moment for you so why should people consume your content is something that the question you want to ask yourself every single day i'm seeing lots of people who are consistent even me as well i ask my you know whenever i write a piece of content i double check that content if this is something that my people would like to you know read or would they you know find value in my post or i delete that post even the twitter screenshot you are watching that you know four five lines i spent 20 25 minutes sometimes to write those screenshot think about that i consume a lot and then i think i process and then i you know try to put that content out there so that is something because i want to put something valuable in front of my audience even the slides as well i spent hour to you know create these slides so why should people consume your content people love to spend time on social media this is true the i love to spoke i also want to you know uh, scroll instagram reels or you know watch facebook and what other people are doing and they are on social media because they want to consume if you want to do business on social media platform you have to think practically that how you can have that attention and how you can you know other people who are your target audience can actually consume your content you have to think that and it's not a straight forward way right let's go to the next slide and let me tell you why it's not straight forward so you see this is the tweet this is my today's tweet people will read your content every single day literally i'm ready i'm opening emails every single day just like they read newspaper the only thing that separates readable content from non readable content is that the former is produced to serve while the latter is produced to sell so you might have seen lots of lots of facebook posts who are look like like this why you need funnel why you need automation why you need ai this is this is bad type of post you should not create these type of posts because this is something you can sense the feeling of sales from such content you know they are trying to sell you something they are trying to you know push their services to you but once in a week it's a once in a while it's something that is okay but i don't think you should create content like this because this is clearly says that you don't understand the social media world the whole social media world and the platform as well every single platform is different facebook is different and that's why i want you to go into the basics of the platform basics of this social media world and that's what will separate you from this other you know post creator it's pretty simple you know understand the basics let's go to the next step how you will understand the basics of the social media world and social media platform why do we open social media every single day why 
do, do are we going to open this social media post every single day to read this type of content why in it funnel why in it automation why in your ai why in your my services xyz this promotional stuff or are you going to open this social media for a particular reason and there is a reason why people open actually these social media platforms why do you open social media platform every day ask yourself spend some time you know this is the, this is something that will give you answer do you do you open this facebook instagram or twitter or youtube to read this promotional post every single day no you don't you want to consume something there is something that you are looking for from this social media platforms and that is the same thing your audience is also looking from this platforms and you have to give that if you want their attention if you want to generate traffic okay this is the basics why do your audience open social media every day you have to give this answer okay to consume content right this is the basic so give them a reason to stop and consume your content do not do not do not post this type of posts please okay let's go to the next step this will give you more clarity okay so if people are there to consume on social media platforms then there are one of these reasons might be your audience are on social media platforms either they want entertainment either they are there to socialize or either they are do, there for business i'm in this category so what group does your audience fall under maybe they are a combination of these two maybe they are a combination of these three or maybe they are in one of these categories maybe it's up to you right so uh in my case i'm in business uh, my audience is also in business my audience is business plus entertainment as well some kind of audience okay so entertainment provide them entertainment socialize socialize with them and business give value network etc whatever you can do on social platforms but understand the social media world okay don't just you know create content and just post it blindly understand the basics why are your audience present on this social media platform at the first place once you know these basics and how you can create entertainment content there is also thing that you can create entertainment content literally in business as well you can socialize in business there are ways in business you can give value you can network there are dozens of things you can do let's go to the next slide so this is something that is my screenshot my profile screenshot okay you can see it post reach every single day two times a day i'm trying to post and sometimes once a day so 3rd october 3rd october you can see two post 2nd october two post 1st october only one post 30 september two post you can see the post reach now my target is let's say uh oh, we will go to the next slide so post reach is 132 158 100 100 100 average you can say 130 something like average of that uh, every single post so let's go to the next step so this is my 28 days last 28 days my post reach is 4340 which is pretty less i know because i was not working on reach every single week you have to choose one goal either you will work for traffic either you will work for leads either you will work for nurturing or either you will work for booking calls and when you are working on one of these other will fall okay this is going to happen you cannot pull all the you know put all the four pillars up here i'm talking about four pillars okay so this is something my reach and there was time like in i think may or june month i had reach of 20000 25000 think of this 20 25000 because i was working on traffic and that's why i had that that much of reach so this is the screenshot of my twitter i spent only 2 or 3 minute when i opened twitter and i you know whenever i i just take that my content and best on twitter and that's it and i'm still getting some of the reach when i was pretty active on twitter in 2021 my impressions were you know literally literally 30000 40000 that much impressions i used this is just an average number 30 40000 twitter is also very good platform to you know go in front of audience so you can have a target of whatever target you want let me show you about uh linkedin this is about linkedin 7 days uh, impressions 1000 this is traffic okay 4000 1000 1000 seven days this is traffic and uh, different different platforms i'm combining and i'm telling you this is this is traffic so how can you have more traffic now we are talking about the traffic today right so how can you have more traffic on your facebook or any platform more traffic mean more impressions more reach right we have seen here this is this is more impressions this is more reach 
this is reach 4000 5000 how can we have how can we have that more impressions more reach let's go to the basics you have to think about how can you have more impressions and more reach if you want more traffic right let's go to the more basics if you want more impressions it's pretty simple you have to understand the platform and win the algorithm which is really hard but how can you win the algorithm there are lots of ways but simple things are more likes and more comments for each platform there are different different uh, metrics but we'll talk about facebook more likes more comments there are some other things as well now you have to think simply practically that how you can have more likes and how you can have more comments when you are posting a comment if you want to win the algorithm and if you win the algorithm you'll have more impressions if you have more impressions that means you have more traffic that's it so you have to either win the algorithm or either produce more pieces of content which is what i am doing 14 times a week because i don't have time for you know other activities maybe i can hire someone or i'll do that if i want to you can see i am posting 14 pieces of content 15 pieces of content every single week so that if you combine this 100 plus 200 plus 400 600 whatever it is then maybe i'll get you know my target number which is 10000 maybe i have a target of 10000 impressions this week then i'll work accordingly and weekly you should have targets you should have goals like if i'm working on traffic in in next 7 days i'll generate 10000 impressions whatever it takes for that i will create 14 times a week. i'll post 14 times a week or 30 times a week it does not matter i will work on that 10000 impressions i want 10000 impressions other otherwise i will have i'll think <clears throat> the best i can to get more likes and more comments you think your imagination is the limit you know you think how you can how people will like for example how people will comment on your profile you can see this post uh, let me go let me go you experiment with your thoughts you experiment with your content of course i will tell you but uh, you can see this type of post i got 32 comments and 45 likes so whenever i'm posting my photo with something with my story or something like that struggle or something like that i'm getting more engagement and more likes so this tells me that i need to create this type of content more if i want more impressions more traffic more reach that's simple if i'm creating instagram or sorry facebook reels now listen to this very careful sentence instagram reels has 5x more reach than anything else on uh, Facebook, Facebook Reels, Facebook Reels. So I want you to go all in to create Facebook Reels. This is something that I am I am also you know going to do. So you can see that whenever I'm using my photo, I'm getting more reach. And uh, this Twitter screenshot, it's okay, okay, but still I'm getting some types of impressions. <clears throat> let's go, let's go here. Okay, produce more content. If you want to have hit that target, produce more content or the last thing is distribute more. Ah, uh, you can do this as well because Instagram stories has more reach <coughs> than any other thing. Instagram post algorithm works like this. You post, then it will show you show that post to 10% of your audience. And if they interact with your post, then it will show it to the next 10% of the people. That's how the algorithm works. But if you add to stories, if you have 10,000 followers, every single person can watch that story. That's the difference. So I want you to go all into stories as well. Add stories every single day. This is a form of distribution and it is something that will give you more eyeballs. People will people love to, you know, scroll through stories as well. Let me drink some water. Mm. Distribute more content. Stories, Facebook groups. You can use Facebook groups. I don't use. Uh, email list is something you know very good way all you have to do is take a piece of content send to your email list or your friends email list or your collaborations email list and pull that audience to your uh, social media profile or other platforms as well like i'm posting on other platforms and i'm taking all the people from different different platforms to one place it's very important to you have to gather them at one place in the end that's it. So I can go deeper into this is just about content and I can, you know, talk more and more about this content. But this is something basic practices I want you to do. Now, let me give you a simple homework that I want you to do. Please do this. Create small pieces of content 
seven small pieces of content. I forgot to add seven here. Seven, like every single day I'm posting Twitter screenshot. So <clears throat> create small pieces of content, seven, and share on your profile before noon. Why before noon? Because this is my practice. Every single day before 12, I try to, you know, share one Twitter screenshot every day. Second thing, create seven long or mid form posts and share on your profile. That's what I do every day, different, different types of posts. And if you don't know what to post, how to post, go into the pinned comment, click on the third or fourth. I don't remember the link. Third or fourth link, you can see, you know, create posts strategically. You can click on the link, watch all the lectures, five lectures telling about everything about how to create content. And then what is this? I wanted to measure. Okay, this is a spelling mistake. Measure the seven day reach and share in the group. Okay, that's what I want you to do. And have a target for this next seven days that I want to reach. I want to have 10,000 impression or 5,000. 10,000 is something that I want you to you know, have target. And go for, you know, whatever you can do for likes, comments, and create, you know, experiment with your content. Experiment what is something that is working. If you create reels, Facebook reels, Wow, this is going to give you a lot of, lot of, lot of reach. So go for this. And if you like this video, hit the like. That's it. That's it for today. And in the next week, uh, I'll talk about traffic leads, or I will cover one of the, you know, uh, another leg from this traffic as well. So yeah, let me. Hmm, how can I remove myself from the stage?